while a former vice president of the United States was in Omaha. He was there today for a special ceremony. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Evan Hummel has a little bit of what's going on around our state. Former Vice President Joe Biden was a keynote speaker at the Buffett Cancer Center dedication ceremony. I bet you almost every one of you in this audience has been touched by cancer. He was in Omaha for the ribbon cutting to unveil the Fred and Pamela Buffett Cancer Center. The facility cost over $300 million to build and was made possible by several contributors, most notably Walter Scott and his late wife, Suzanne. It's the biggest project ever done by the University of Nebraska Medical Center. Biden, who lost his son Beau to brain cancer in 2015 at the age of 46, has vowed to fight the rest of his life to end the disease. There's so much more we could do to give those extra days, weeks, months, just by additional access to information. In addition, the Jahuli Center was introduced Friday, which is part of the center. It features glasswork from renowned artist Del Jahuli. It's meant to provide a calming and beautiful setting for patients and families. The vice president was there partly because he launched his own program called the Biden Cancer Initiative. It's aimed to help with diagnosis and research of the disease, something he says the center can help with. If only one breakthrough comes, it could save a whole heck of a lot of lives. The building is 10 stories and features 108 beds. Combined with many research laboratories, the state-of-the-art facility will employ nearly 1,200 people as well. Reporting from Omaha, Evan Hummel, Channel 8 Eyewitness News. All right.